Hi guys, my name is Michael Mark. So today it's uh, raining, so I live in North Carolina. Um, the weather is not really good, look at that. <laughs> so I sent some money to Putak and Puwood to do charity work at Cambodia. But now he traveled to Saang and Kandal Providence and the village Spian Sela and Srok Saang. Srok Saang it means district. So one of the poor family he going there to helping them but he just travel across the, the Cambodian country. So I'm um, live in the United States of course I used to go through all those hard times and then but I, I I'm here and we got everything. You got a car, you got a house everything you know that we need and we get more than we need it okay those people it pretty poor like mostly the poverty families and don't know how to start their life to break it through for those a uh, probably you know life and the generation by generation they left behind the poor, no education, and then too much despair for their lives. And then, but I was here uh, with a lot of hope and uh, the new land, a new opportunity, changing my life. I start with nothing too. Um, I was poor like them too. I'm Cambodian. And I remember those times, but right now it's time to help, you know, the best I can. Uh, his name is Chop, and his wife's name is Poe. And Mr. Chop, he's 64 years old, and Mrs. Poe, 65 years old, and they got 11 kids. You see how poor it is? See? And then he make for a living before he breaking the gravel from the mountain and he sell it, earn a little money, but he works so hard, you know, how, how, how the labor job, like you go to the mountain, they have the, the big stone, the solid stone, and you break it, and then you into a small piece and you sell. You can, in the United States, all over the place, like Home Depot and stuff, you can see the crowd. Okay. But he make a little money, it working hard to raise 11 kids, because he used, to have like his wife before, but his wife died, left behind five kids. And that his ex-wife, he just got married, so she got five kids too. And after they got married, they got one more kid, the total 11. But of course, his wife right now, Poe is his wife's sister, but Chuck is the uh, before, is a brother-in-law, okay, for her. But now they, they husband and wife, because they they go around. They couldn't find anything to help. Only, you know, the closer family. You know how his house and how they look like and how their life. They don't even have enough food to eat. and no job available. You know how hard their life. It both of them raised eleven kids, and after that he got like high blood pressure, he fell and broke his left hand. You can see like popping up and then uh, the bone from the, his hand. 
But after he was, he was in the hospital, the little hill, but he come back, he still have no food to stop him, to support all the family, and no income, no anything. But he had to went out there to work, and then to earning some little income. It's hard to earn it. But his hand was broken, it's not healed yet by falling because he had high blood pressure. But you can see his hand is popping, the bone popping because he's working, like your job's not healed yet. And then he had to struggle on his life. He had to face on his poverty life and family generation by generation. So after that, yeah, his wife got separated because it's so poor, you know, they couldn't afford it, they didn't live with her daughter. And who would and who talk when they asked the question. ไอ้ลูกโซ่ท่าอมจีเนี่ยเอ่อดักมองดักบะไก่ให้ไถ่ลิงไถ่ไอ้ตึ๊ดๆน้องไม้ดักหลุนไอ้ก็ตึ๊
or one kilogram, but now he make a dry fish and dry on his roof. And when Puwut went there, he want to give to Puwut some, but Puwut said no. But he still pack up and give it to Puwut. How nice these poor people! You know, I would like to help, and then I like to share all this trip story to the world, and you can see their real life. It open up this pack of Cambodian poverty. Uh, I don't know how to help but only making this video it probably can open this page to the world and people live in the United States or anywhere if you want to donate or you want to helping them please leave the comment it will start from there if you would like to help please share this video and click subscribe and then click notification bell to get new video upload and more of you more people look at it so um, more people interested it means they're helping them it's a lot of people out there need help with the poor people their life so despair and no future no school no education no income because it's so poor in Cambodia it's no job available hi guys uh, thank you for your support and your watching We'll see you guys on the next video. You guys have a wonderful holiday and Happy New Year 2023 coming tomorrow, tonight. Bye-bye now. Have a great day.